All right, Coach, another day of practice. Talk about uh, what happened right off the get-go, sudden change. Well, yeah, one of the things we do uh, during the course of practice is uh, not all the time. We have what we call sudden change, and, and, and it accomplishes two things. Number one, it's a turnover, so the offense either has to take the field after our defense gets it and scores, or our defense has to take the field and hold them after our offense turns the ball over. So it, it accomplishes that. And then I put it on the 25-yard line, so it also accomplishes overtime period and we've been pretty good in overtime periods we've won most of those so I think uh, it's a good thing to do and and one of the things I did I did it right after stretching so we got their attention real quick yeah, a, lot of, a lot of action out there today a lot of uh, scrimmage plays and whatnot but uh, Ryan Rome had a pretty good day today too kicking field goals yeah Ryan's really improved you know we recruited him out of Destrehan uh, he used to kick off a tee in high school and he really had a hard time transitioning to kicking off the the turf, but uh, he's worked very hard on it in the off season, and he had a nice, uh, nice field goal, a long one, and and uh, didn't miss today. So he, he's doing a nice job. Talk about you, just your team's overall performance today. A lot, of, a lot, of, a lot going on out there today. You had the scrimmages, you had the, the scale of terms of thuds. You had yeah. A lot of stuff happening. Well, we did a lot of things, a lot of situational things, and and then uh, you know you can only scrimmage so many days in spring. The NC2A only allows so many days. One of them was today, so we had some scrimmage plays today. We ended it with about 20 plays or so. And uh, again, it's it, it's a young football team still, although it's a more experienced football team. And uh, I think it's important that we get a, as many scrimmage plays as we can in now, so that we we don't have to do as many in the fall, so we can try to keep them healthy. And just talk about just overall your team's health and state of being right now. They're in pretty good shape right now. Well, I think for the most part, yeah, we're in pretty good shape. We've had very few serious injuries. We've had a few nicks and bumps, and uh, you know you always keep your fingers crossed that you stay healthy. But uh, uh, the conditioning, I think, has really paid off. Uh, Derek Ashley, our strength and conditioning coach, has done a nice job of getting them in physical shape for spring ball, and and they're obviously bigger, they're stronger, they're more athletic. And uh, when, when you are that way, you have a tendency to have less injuries. Just real quick, talk about you told your team's attitude. You said you've been pleased with the attitude so far. Well, talk I, about how that's been going. Yeah, I just think the, the attitude is very positive. You know, the coaches have been positive, uh, and, and the players, you know, they're tired of losing, and they want to win, and, and they know that this is an important year for us. Uh, uh, these seniors would like to go to a bowl game, and unless you win six, you don't ever have that opportunity. So the attitude is great because they've worked hard in the offseason, and uh, there's a lot of continuity right now. There's, there's a lot of guys that are returning that have played a lot of football for us. So, so it's a really good team atmosphere right now.